the future of our race not worth a single human life? Uh, get up! You'll never stop at one! I'll take you all on! This is TRM Plays right back for another review. And today, whoo, we are reviewing a heck a good person. And today we're going to be reviewing the studio series Revenge of the Fallen. Optimus Prime. The leader of the Autobots. In the rival of the Revenge of the Fallen Megatron we reviewed not too long ago. This Optimus is so freaking cool. He is so well detailed. And he is so well just... I I'm speechless about this figure guys. He is just so freaking legit. I, I, I can't get enough of this guy. Like... The details on him, amazing, bro. The, the they did this figure really well. I, I, they did work on him and his blades. Clear plastic, you all. His blades are really good. Really, really, really good, guys. They did amazing work on these, and as you could tell, they hooked on the undersides of his hands put those to the side let's get into the figure and his articulation his articulation oh my god you guys are gonna love this his articulation really good well over 90 degree bend at the knee and his knee pad articulation which is really nice ankle rock Due to transformation, and he does have foot swivel, and remove his arms out. He can go out that far, kick back oh, that far, and he can kick forward that far. And for his um. Arms out that far, full 360 down at that at the shoulder, full rotation at the bicep, and this guy has hand articulation. And for his head, he has a ball joint up and down, left and right. It is very limited due to his chin, but that is him in his butt form and oh my gosh he looks so amazing you all and he screams the word optimus down at everybody don't mind the keyboard i moved it away so you guys can see this amazing figure yes he's being reviewed on my xbox it's okay though He's just amazing though. I really like what they did to him. And for a quick size comparison, I got here the Revenge of the Fallen Megatron. Here he is. Side to side, Megatron does look way huge over him. Um. If we do mess with his knee joints, but oh my goodness, he is significantly taller than him. 
But I think that is movie accurate since Megatron is pretty tall. I mean, he always was hunched down though, then that makes it better. We'll take him away and we will get revealed into Optimus's transformation. So if we get into transformation here, what you really want to do, you want to go to his legs, move his feet kind of up like that, then his legs are going to do something weird. So then the whole thing is going to flip around and flip like that. And you vividly see his toe hitch from his feet. I like to peg everything now. Peg those two together. Right here on the side, you want to flip that up. That down. Rinse and repeat over here on this side. Over and down. Then you want to take Optimus's arms here. And you want to get them up like this. You kind of want to rotate them over this way because then you want to be doing something like this. You want to dehinge this part here and this part here. Then moving these two pieces together, folding everything together, getting that in and together. And that should be good. These pieces are not really pegged in much. They're they're pegged in very very flimsy like yeah see. But maybe if we do this, pegging this, pegging this, and then Yeah, they're just flimsy, so you're just gonna have to deal with it, but over here we'll lift the as you can tell, that does go down. We'll put that down all the way, then lift his arms back up. Then you want to flip these out. Those will become his front in a minute. Then you want to... I personally like to peg these in, his arms together, right now. Um, mushroom peg came off. With this mold I have, his mushroom peg likes to come off here. So that's nice. That's fine. Um, that down in there. Move it over. Up that. Is it going to peg itself again? His arms are quite finicky. <laughs> Once they're together, they're pretty good together. But what you have to really work on is to get them together. So there. Now, then you want that to go down again, and that to go up. And that to go up like that with his mushroom peg coming off. I'm sorry, he's kind of being difficult. There it is. There. That's how you want it to look like on his front. It kind of looks like an angel. Then you want to do these. this, then you flip it, and we'll flip it on to cover his engine. Then doing this, doing this, and doing this. If it'll stay together here. There's that, there's that, and there's that. 
There's the front, pretty much. And he looks like he has a pot belly. But it's okay. Then you want to flip these out. These gas cans, flip that. And put the pickup in. It'll kind of do something over here, but then peg, them, peg everything back together. Then over here again, same thing, and it'll flip these panels out accordingly. They leave them where they are, you don't have to mess with them. Then now you want to go to his head, leave that down, then you want to flip that, and put that on his window. And over here, you want to flip these respective pieces back on themselves. And that might change these back, that's okay. And right then you just take this up there, and these up there down, and that. It's kind of like difficult because there's this like space is on But now we will get to this piece. Then you want to flip this around his whole torso. Then you flip it up. Then you want to take these wheels, flip them out, get them ready. Flip that up. All stay. And that's okay, and we can wear it perfect. Then you want to move these into that compartment, or that will stay. Then you can put these front wheels over the middle. That does pop out. I don't know, it's difficult. There we go. Be okay. Perfect. And these back into place. Oh. Um, now you want to put these gas cans right. It up, down, good. Then you want to put these swords onto these respected areas here. One there, and the other one. And the other side. You can do it away. This way for my personal and it is kinda hard to get that in there. There, there we go. Now and that, ladies and gentlemen. Robin is crying in his amazing truck form. And that you guys is Optimus Prime's truck form. Um it's very intricate. I really like what they did on this guy. They really... Oh man, they knocked him out of the park. I... I could have seen an Optimus Prime from, from this movie particularly done so nicely. Yes, he's old, but oh man, he... He screams amazing. I've always liked the distance of the Optimus Forms suits his name. They did good on him. I really like how they did this trick form. Rolling. You can roll him just like that. His wheels and everything are fine. Nothing gets in the way. That, ladies and gentlemen, is Optimus Prime. And, well, 
I hope you guys enjoyed this review. Please hit a like and a subscribe. And please hit the bell for an amazing notification from me, TRM Plays. And you know what? This is TRM Plays signing off. And you know what? Preparing for the future with everything gaming. Hopefully here soon. This is TRM Plays signing off. Peace out. Soundwave acknowledges.